of you Facebookers out there. Good evening to all of you. Lakeisha McKnight is here. We're about to get going. It's about 7.32 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on this Tuesday, August the 11th. And so I do want to welcome every one of you to the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. Welcome to the Night Show, guys. Glad to be here tonight with each and every one of you. And um, I'm a leadership specialist, wealth mentor, and an author of several books, but the latest one being the Leadership TKO Live, not even Leadership TKO Live, correction, Leadership TKO, all right, and that's 12 Truths to Implement to Become a Winning Leader. But this is the Leadership TKO Live night show, and we do this show every single evening somewhere around 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and um, you're more than welcome to tune into the show every single night. And so the purpose of the show and the brand really is to empower leaders like yourself with the ability to win from the inside out, growing your influence, your impact, and your income. So that is what our goal is, is to help you to grow and become an influential leader, to be able to impact other people's lives, and to also grow your income. That's right. So if you want to do any of those, you are in the right place at the right time. And so we welcome you here and we thank you so much for plugging in. So what I'm going to do, and I encourage you all to do, feel free to go ahead and share this out. I'm going to share this out to a couple of places really quick before we dive in tonight. So let me go ahead and do that. All right. And let's see. Yep. One more other place and we should be good to go. Perfecto. Perfecto. So yes, if you want to do any of that, if you want to grow your income, go ahead and like or love the stream. You can also comment below any questions you have, any comments that you would like to make, go ahead and post those, those comments below. And then also do a watch party and share this out with those that you care about, even your business partners, your colleagues who you want to help to grow as well. So being a part of this show, you all probably know by now that I provide a bit of an appetizer. So really just something just to kind of wet your palate a bit so that you can prepare for the main meal. And so the appetizer that I do want to share with you on tonight, we're continuing in with this final nugget. That's right. Yep, yep. A final nugget, okay, from Dr. John Maxwell's book. And so I'm going to share my screen so you can see what I'm seeing. And it's from his book, uh, Developing the Leader Within. So all of you should be able to see my screen right now. And so the concept we want to focus in on tonight is vision, vision, okay? Because John Maxwell, he teaches us, you know, all effective leaders have a vision, you know, of what they have to accomplish, you know, and that vision becomes the energy behind every effort and the force that pushes through all the problems. You see, the leader with a vision becomes a mission which is contagious and felt among other people until they all begin to rise alongside the leader. See, combine a leader with a vision and he, he's willing to implement and a movement actually begins, okay? People don't follow a dream in itself. They follow the leader who has that dream and the ability to communicate it effectively. Right. And so think about you could think about this with a lot of other things, because there's another author. In fact, Simon Sinek, he argues that a vision is so important. People don't even buy into a leader until they buy into his vision, his why. OK, so because they need to know that the leader's reason for doing things is not for themselves, but for something greater than themselves. Okay, it has to be something beyond themselves. And so if, if other people can sense that, then we can rally behind it and we can support it. And see, that is so, so very important, guys. And so it's great to be able to connect with a leader, someone who has a vision. You got to understand that leader's why, and you'll be able to lock arms. So for example, for those of you who are wealth builders out there, you're connected to the e-commerce company that was created by Dr. Right, Harold Seitz. And we know about his vision. And because we know his upbringing, we know his passion, because he wants people to be free. He believes that everyone has a right to be free. 
And so because we know about his vision of trying to get gold into the hands of millions of honest people around the world, until we, we see, we know that he wants people to be free from the current system of debt. And so we can rally behind that. We can support that. And as a matter of fact, for those of you wealth builders, if you are in support of that mission and you support the fact that Dr. Harold Zeitz has a vision and you are 100% behind that vision, go ahead and shout out their gold, okay? Gold, go ahead and reply in the post, gold, 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 because you are behind the vision that we want to get gold into the hands of millions of honest people around the world. That is the vision, and we support and back that. And so because we know his vision, we can follow him. We can support him. All right. So it's all about developing the vision within you. So and this is the reason why it makes it easy for, I believe, a lot of entrepreneurs who are network marketers, especially to be able to go out there and attract people to them. Right. It's not by compelling someone to do it or forcing someone to do it. When they see your passion, when they see your hunger, when they see your thirst and that you have a noble cause, they're going to rally behind it. They're going to want to attach themselves to that because they sense the energy. Some people call it vibration. I just call it energy. I call it positive energy. And so when they can sense that positive energy, they can get behind that vision and that reason why you're doing what you're doing. That's what we call attraction marketing. It's going to attract people to come to connect with you and to want to do business with you and to want to go on the journey with you. And if you agree with that, go ahead and let me know. I got, I felt that thing. Go ahead and let me know in the comment section. If you agree with that, you can get behind someone who has a vision, someone who has a greater purpose beyond themselves. And so you want to develop that for yourself. That's a part of developing you. Developing, you know, really sensing and finding out a vision, having a vision for your life. And so again, develop that vision, develop you. And I'm telling you, there are going to be people who want to connect with you and want to follow you until the ends of the world. Okay. They're going to want to do some amazing things with you. And so you want to make sure that you focus on developing a vision for yourself. And I'm hoping that you've enjoyed that nugget. <laughs> that appetizer got me fired up. I'm telling you, I'm ready to go. I'm going to run some laps right now, even though it's raining outside. I'll go run some laps in some rain. Okay. Don't let rain, rain doesn't stop me. You all know I'm originally from New Jersey. So rain, hail, sleet, snow, we're going out. <laughs> okay. We are going out. It does not stop us. Even though I'm in Virginia, I wasn't born in Virginia guys. Look, I was born in New Jersey. And I will go out in all types of weather, okay? That doesn't stop us. All right, so I want to get to the main meal. How many of you want to get to the main meal tonight? The main meal has a lot to do with um, the book that I've been kind of delving into and sharing with you guys, and that is 103 Ways to Fail in Network Marketing, A Guide to Your Success. And this is a book uh, that was put together by my network marketing mentors, Mrs. Valerie and Mr. Ty Bess, and this was published in 2003, but it's still practical. It's still what you can apply, you know, to really be the professional in network marketing that you desire to be. If you want to be successful, you do what the successful people do, and they have tons of success. You know, Mr. Bess was inducted into the Network Marketing Hall of Fame, and so if you want to truly, truly know this profession and be successful, you want to stay tuned and plug in to this series that I'm giving you because it's going to help you to grow by leaps and bounds, help you to avoid some common pitfalls, you know, as you're on the journey of being a successful network marketer. So tonight, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to give you the sixth way to fail in network marketing. I'm going to read to you what's here, and then I'm going to expound on it. And you can share your experience in the comment section as well. I want to be able to hear from you. I want to be able to know your experience with this nugget. Okay. Are you ready? You ready? Here we go. The sixth way to fail in network marketing is fail to keep your appointments. Fail to keep your appointments. That's the sixth way to fail in network marketing. Here's what they say. I know, I know. <sighs> Didn't we just cover that? <laughs> okay, yes and no. 
because learning to keep your word in as many as many things in the appointments isn't just the beginning. Okay. See, however, if you fail to keep appointments, you will never build a team. Again, if you fail to keep appointments, you will never build a team. Here's what he says. Furthermore, we have seen people promote a big meeting for 30 days. Okay. 30 days. They have invited dozens of people. And then the night of the event, they don't feel like going. So they call a team member and say, if any of the guests show, take care of them. This will not work. Okay. That will not work. You see the prospect, what's going to happen is the prospects, you know, they're going to lose faith in you and the company before he or she has a chance to even get started. This is true for any meeting. Always show up. Each meeting, I believe whether it's a virtual meeting or a live in-person meeting, each meeting is worth a thousand dollars to you. You just don't know it. And so you have to believe. So listen, if you have an appointment, keep it. And we know that sometimes things happen. We get it. But you want to, it it can't be something where it intentionally happened. If there's a crisis that happened, of course, that's a crisis. And you want to get back with them. But you want to keep your appointments. If you have a follow-up appointment, if you have, you know, a meeting on Zoom where you have to explain something to, you know, a particular group of individuals, or even if it's one person, you want to honor that meeting. Keep your word. You don't want there to be a bad reputation for the company itself because you didn't follow through with an appointment. And again, each day will get better. All right. We know that we're human and sometimes things happen. So plan to do better. Okay. Do better. That's all that you can do is do better. So again, the sixth way to fail in network marketing is to fail to keep your appointment. So in other words, you want to honor every appointment that you set, whether it's an initial one or a follow-up appointment or a presentation that you're supposed to be giving, keep your word, fulfill your appointment. So for example, I have an appointment coming up this Saturday. Okay. Can I just give you a transparent moment? And because uh, the group is in another country, I have to, along with possibly two of my partners, we have to be ready and be ready to give information at three o'clock in the morning on Saturday. I'm going to let that marinate for a second. Because you know I'm going to be like this, right? (laughs) I'm going to have to make sure I have something with a little bit of caffeine in it so I can be ready. (laughs) Okay? Because 3 o'clock in the morning, I'm normally sitting somewhere or actually, I'm actually in realm sleep right now. I'm in another level of sleep at 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm just going to be honest with you. So again, I'm going to have to make sure I have the energy, whether I have some water on me, whatever it is that I need to do have some water or whatever so that I can refresh myself and be ready for that presentation at three o'clock in the morning on Saturday with a big old smile on my face. (laughs) Okay. So honor your appointments. People respect those that do what they say they're going to do. Okay. That there are people of integrity, allow their yes to be yes and their no to be no. Okay. So again, I thank you so very much for tuning into the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. Again, there's some special things going on. If you didn't hear or didn't view the presentation that I did at 6.30, listen, many of you know that I'm connected to a wealth building uh, organization. It's an e-commerce company based out of Germany. And we are connecting people all around the world to this thing. People who want access to real money. They're coming to understand that this is not real money, but this right here, is real money. They're coming to understand that. And if you need to be educated or informed about it, it's okay. It's a right to say, I need information about understanding about what real money is. And that's the information we're going to provide for you tonight. As a matter of fact, at nine o'clock PM on goldrocks.info, if you go to that URL, goldrocks.info, and it's on the Zoom platform. So make sure you do download the app first. But on goldrocks.info at nine o'clock, you can get a presentation where another one of my colleagues are going to break down, share the information about real money and how you can access it. 
Okay. And listen, for those of you who are wealth builders already, you're already plugged in. There is some training that's taking place tonight at eight o'clock PM. Uh, Mr. Williams, he does the training every 11th of the month where he shares with you how you can understand more about the Unilevel system, where you can understand how you're going to be getting paid and ranking up, you know, for those you invite into this organization, this e-commerce company. So to get a better understanding of how all, all of that works, you can be on the training tonight at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's going to be over at goldrocks.info as well. And listen, you can get on these trainings, but you need, need, need the password. The platform itself is password protected, so you will not be able to get on unless you have the password. So for those of you who are on, you know, you're connected to Wealth Builders, listen, get the password from someone. If you are a guest and you're trying to get to the nine o'clock presentation, inbox me or the person that shared this with you so we can get the password over there to you, okay? So I appreciate your time tonight. Another episode of the Leadership TKO Live Night Show. We're going to be coming back and doing this thing on tomorrow night around 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I do know tomorrow is Wednesday. So either it's going to be 7.30 or a little bit before that because we do have a meeting at 7.45 tomorrow and I don't want it to be too much of a crunch. So we may do it a little bit earlier than 7.30. So stay tuned. We'll let you know. Okay, so until the next time that you and I come together again, I do encourage you to think, to speak, and to live leadership. Good night, everyone. God bless. And hopefully I'll catch you on the Gold Rocks platform on tonight.